Hi, good morning. Let's do some breath work and some upper body mobility today. So we're going to be, throughout the entire workout, just sitting up cross-legged. Sit evenly on the sit bones and have your hands on your knees. And let's do some couple cat cows just to mobilize the spine. If it's hard for you to sit upright on the floor, you can sit on a yoga block, a foam roller, bolster, or you can also do this from a chair. The goal is to sit upright and keep the pelvis upright. So the first exercise is let's do some breath work, hands on your knees, sit upright and let's do 10 deep breaths into your chest. Deep breath in and long exhale out. Deep breath in and long exhale. Deep breath in and long exhale. Deep breath in, fill up your lungs. And long exhale. And six deep inhale. And long exhale. Imagine I'm right above you and I'm pulling your hair up just to force you to sit up tall. Deep inhale. And long exhale. Three more. Deep inhale. And long exhale. Long exhale. And last one, deep inhale. And long exhale. Next, let's switch our legs. And let's have our hands out in front of us, sit evenly on the sit bones, arms pointing forward, arms are straight. And let's do some shoulder mobility here. So we're gonna uh, shrug our shoulder blades up, shrug them down like you want to put them in your back pocket. You're gonna push your arms forward if your scapula, your shoulder is were elevator doors, they would be opening. And last, you're gonna retract your arms and imagine that, again, the shoulder blades are elevator doors. You want to close the elevator door. If there was a hazelnut between your shoulder blades, you would wanna crack them. So let's do shrug up, down, forward, like you want to hug someone, and back, crack that hazelnut. Up, down, forward, and back. Up, down, keep sitting upright on the sit bones, forward, and back. I'm right above you, pulling your hair upright. Forward and back. Crack that hazel up. Especially try to crack the hazel at the bottom of your scapula. Forward and back. 
forward and back up and down and last one up and back down okay next hands let's switch the legs hands on your knees sit up tall and pulling your hair upright and we're just going to turn our head right and left Imagine there is a conversation behind you. You're very curious of what's happening. You're eavesdropping, but you don't want them to notice you. So just gently keep your chest open, hands on your knees, sitting up tall. Gently turn your head and listen to the conversation behind you. Go as far as your tissue allows you and then come back to center. Sit up tall, don't collapse, and turn your head to the other side. You may notice that your range of motion to one side is bigger than to the other side. And that's normal. Take deep breaths into your belly. Deep inhale and long exhale. Sit up, fall, don't collapse. Come back to center. And one more, last one. Rotate your head to the right. Listen to the conversation behind you. Don't let, when you're rotating to the right, don't let your left shoulder come forward. So keep your chest open. Back to center. And last one to the left. Sit up tall. Rotate just the head. Keep your right shoulder back. and back to center. Let's switch legs. You can also move around if you feel that you're tired from sitting. Again, you can sit up on a bolster, yoga block, or you can also do this from a chair. And then next, hands on your, no, actually, let's do this one. Cross your arms in front of you, hug yourself, and let's rotate the body. So we're gonna sit up tall, your hips are pointing forward and you're rotating to the right. Bring your entire body to the right, back to center and now to the left. Back to center. You're here too, you, you can notice, you will notice that your range of motion to the right or left is different. Back to center and to the left. Back to center. And here what you have to pay attention to is that don't shear out to the side. Imagine that you're in a very narrow tube and you're lengthening upwards as you're rotating. So no shearing, but it's called axial elongation. You're lengthening up and above you, pulling your hair upright as you're rotating. <clears throat> Last one to the left. Lift and rotate. And back to center. Switch the legs again, hands behind your occiput, sit up tall, and you're going to bring your right elbow to your right knee, back to center, left elbow to left knee. Keep your sit bone 
down. Keep both sit bones down. So don't let, in this case, don't let your right sit bone rise up as you are side bending to the left. And here, keep your left sit bone down. Press your left sit bone into the mat and feel the stretch on your side. Back to center. Left elbow to left knee. You can also play with your right elbow here. So curl a little forward and back to the ceiling. Right elbow to right knee. Play with your left elbow. Rotate your spine backwards, but keep your left sit bone down. Back to center. And last one. Left to left. Back to center. Bring your hands back on your knees. Let's do a couple more cat cows here. Next, let's bring your hands behind your occiput again. You're going to bring your right elbow to right knee and we're going to straighten the left arm and pointing in my case there's a corner there so your upper corner of your room and feel a longer stretch in a larger area back to center left elbow to left knee right arm straightens towards the upper corner back to center right elbow to right knee keep your sit bone down left sit bone stays down and the stretch doesn't stop so keep pushing my fingers to the ceiling to the corner ceiling so it's not a lazy stretch the arm is engaged my sit bone is engaged back to center let's switch the legs one last time hands on the knees and let's finish with 10 deep breaths we started with deep, deep breaths into the chest so let's finish with deep breaths into the belly imagine there's a big balloon inside of you and as you take the deep inhale the balloon expands and as you exhale the balloon deflates let's do 10 of us hands on your knees and pulling you upright and deep breath in And three, deep breath in. And four. And five. And six. Seven, eight, nine, deep breath in and long exhale. And ten, last one. That's it. I'll see you soon. Have a good day. Thank you. Bye.